Yeah, yeah, what it do, what it do, man. Young Dre and this motherfucker playing as clean as Cyberpunk 2077 for the five, you dig? Just chilling and shit right now, you know what I'm saying? Just uh, got revived and shit. So let's get back to it, man. All right, go on. Biochip. It's basically a bomb. Fuse lit already. You don't have much time left. Much life. A few weeks tops. Silverhand's construct is overriding your consciousness. Gradually taking over your body until one day you'll just be gone. V, it's important you get all this. <clears throat> Don't believe an ounce of the horseshit coming from your mouth. Know why? Because it doesn't make any goddamn sense. Whatever's happening to me, there's a logical explanation. Gotta be. You're the best of the best, Vic. Why can't you help me? You want the long story or the short? Don't omit a thing. Not one deep. Okay. There was... is a construct. A psyche on the chip. Out of Johnny Silverhand. You jacked it in your chip slot. Nothing happened, right? Until you died. Bullet in the head from Dexter Deshaun. How do you come back from something like that? Low caliber. You lucked out. Not least thanks to another poor decision by Mr. Deshaun. The nanites off the chip started fixing the damage. Then they took your hand and coaxed you off the path toward the light. You're Dr. Victor, and I'm your monster. <laughs> Perfect. Your body's only a body. You can modify it, replace it with chrome, hell, get a new one altogether. Your mind, though? Oh, that's a whole nother story. From the biochip's perspective, your brain cells are a tumor that needs to be scooped out, while your body's an empty shell to hold the construct. So this fucking terrorist wants to wipe me and take my place, take my body. It's not willful on his part, it's automatic. Inevitable. And neither of you can stop it. Can we just take the chip out or switch it off? Either way is out of the question. You die immediately. Fuck. I remember this thing saw it on TV. Oh, it was a stupid slogan. Soul something. Secure your soul. That's it. It's just supposed to let you communicate with constructs. Maybe, but this is a prototype by the look of things. Somehow made it out of Arasaka Labs. Vic, you've always come through for me. If there's nothing you can do to help me, then... What the hell do I do? Tell me, please. Vic. I wish I knew, kid. Misty? You're asking too much from an old-timer like Vic. Come on, V. Let's get you home. And then he died. And I thought I was gonna die with him in my sleep. Sleep's a small hint of death. The inevitable. Can't actually tell if I'm awake now. I mean, I could be dead already, right? Not something to focus on, V. Let it go. 
Here. Got some meds for you. Omega blockers. Taken regularly, they'll keep things from progressing too quickly. Also, they should keep that guest of yours calm and quiet. Pseudoendotrizines from me. Effect will be opposite. It'll speed things up. Free the demon, so to speak. Given me a pill to prod that son of a bitch, so he can kill me faster? Listen, you're likely to be fine for a while. But sometime down the road, it could turn into pure agony. I'm giving you options, honey. The brain can be tricked. Plain old painkillers do that. Your psyche's gonna die, V. You'll feel your old self slipping away. At some point, you won't recognize yourself. It'll be terrifying. It'll be painful. But it doesn't have to be. The fuck I need pills for. How did you stick a gun in my mouth? Pull the trigger. Well, that way you'd kill two souls. Is that what you want? Gotta lie down. Here. Got one more thing for you. Vic pulled this out of your skull. A lucky charm? Promise you'll try to get some sleep. Didn't you hear? My condition's terminal. What good can this do? Don't be silly. As long as you're alive, there's hope. And don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Really think I can make it? Survive this? Of course you can. I mean, you did already die and come back once, didn't you? Missy, wait. Um... About Jackie. Yeah? <clears throat> he... Talked about you. Like, lots. We got into a fight. Right before he went off to do this job. He wasn't mad at you. I hope you know that. I know. I just wish our last moments together could have been... different. But right now, you need rest. So sleep. Please sleep. Get out of here, understand? And I'll kill anyone who gets in my way, you included. Need a smoke. Where'd you stash yours? Get some. Just need one last one. Jesus fucking Christ, man! The fuck kind of joy toy are you supposed to be? <laughs> fucking ghost off! Who you work for? Start talking! Fuck. 
fuck. Fucking chip. Rip the thing out myself. No way. You never, asshole. Now like that, stick some iron in your mouth and pull the trigger. <laughs> I can feel it. Our minds touch it. I'm like mold on fruit creeping into you. Nothing I can do about it. You hear me? I'd puke if I fucking could. It's just a copy of the engram. I'm out there somewhere. Gotta be. Leave me alone! Get out! Just get the fuck out! Let to the head only thing that can fix this. Hear me, bitch! A bullet to the fucking brain! That boy killer.
Okay, do that shit. Yeah, yeah, young Dre and this bitch <clears throat> signing off. I'm gone.